good morning friends today i'm going to solve problem on one dimensional wave equation what students one dimensional wave equation let us see the problem students a string is stretched and fastened to two points l apart l apart so what is the length of the string students l what is the length of the string students l motion is started by displacing the string in the form y is equal to a sin pi x by l from which it is released at a time t is equal to 0 that means initial displacement what students initial displacement what is initial displacement students t is equal to 0 he given a sin pi x by l a sin pi x by l these two are same students now show that the displacement of any point at a distance x from one end at a time t is y of x comma t that is equal to a sin pi x by l into cos pi c t by l that means finally at any time t displacement is he directly given students that is our advantage here a sin pi x by l into cos pi c t by l we have to show this one students right so if you observe the problem this problem is belongs to the concept of one dimensional wave equation okay now what is the wave equation students dou square y by dou t square that is equal to c square into dou square y by dou x square now what is solution of this equation students y of x comma t that is equal to c1 cos px plus c2 sin px into c3 cos pct plus c4 sin pct now why it is suitable solution students i explain in the concept of one dimensional wave equation students you can check there right now what are the conditions and boundary conditions here three four are boundary conditions y at zero comma t is equal to zero y at l comma t is equal to zero now initial displacement is a sin pi x by l now what is the initial velocity students initial velocity is also zero zero now see students from three and two what is three students this condition and two is solution by using these two conditions we get a solution students y of x comma t that is equal to c2 sin px c3 cos pct plus c4 sin pct now see students four condition four and seven this Finally, we get from these using these two, using these two, we get a solution y of x comma t that is equal to sigma n is equal to 1 to infinity a n sin n pi x by l cos n pi c t by l plus b n sin n pi x by l sin n pi c t by l. Again, from 6, 6 means initial velocity students, initial velocity. I am not using this condition students. I want to apply this condition at last students. So, 6 and 8. 8 means this, this solution students. From these two, we get y of x comma t that is a equal to sigma n is equal to 1 to infinity a n sin n pi x by l cos n pi c t by l. Because here we get b n value 0 students. Whenever I am using these two conditions, b n value is 0. b n value is 0. Now, I want to find, I want to substitute the condition this condition students say I need here y of x comma 0 what is the value students a sin a sin pi x by l what is the equation number students 5 and also need here uh, ninth equation students so y of x comma t that is equal to sigma a n sin n pi x by l into cos n pi c t by l this is 9 students i want to by using these two i want to find the value of a n students let us continue students now if anybody want uh, the provisor of the solution in previous case you can check the link in the description students you can check the link in the description students okay you go through the link then you know how to find uh, uh, by using those conditions, so how can you get the solution students? Okay, right. Now, I am using 5 and 9 condition students from 5 and 
9 from 5 and 9 we get we get now what is condition students y x comma 0 so y x comma 0 that is equal to here t is equal to 0 students t is equal to 0 so put t is equal to 0 here so cos 0 value 1 cos 0 value is 1 so we get here sigma n is equal to 1 to infinity a n sin n pi x by l n pi x by l what is y of x comma 0 value students a sin pi x by l a sin pi x by l so that is equal to you substitute n is equal to 1 students here so a 1 sin pi x by l n plus n is equal to 2 students a 2 sin 2 pi x by l plus and so on plus and so on now compare students compare okay now we have sin n pi x by l here here also sin n pi x by l so a1 is equal to students a a1 is equal to a now there is no sin 2 pi x by l students and uh, sin 3 pi x by l so a2 value 0 and what are the what about rest of the term students a3 a4 and so on all the values are 0 all the values are 0 therefore therefore the required solution the required the required solution the required solution is is see students y of x comma t y of x comma t that is equal to that is equal to put n is equal to 1 students you get a1 a1 value students a small a into into sine sine n value 1 students so pi x by l into cos n value 1 students so we get pi c t by l pi c t by l this is the required solution of the required solution of given problem that means at any time the displacement in the string is a sin pi x by l cos pi c t by l this is about this problem students hope you understand please like this video and share it thank you thank you for watching this video jai hind